when I nominated the Butterfly Wall, um, Mark Rosenbach, the artist, firstly I had a chance to chat to him and I think, I think sometimes also when you, when you speak to someone you recognize the beauty in them and I see him as a very beautiful person. I wanted to create something that had a tension with um, preciousness and mundaneness. And that I think was achieved by boxes of butterflies, which are precious and rare in themselves. But they've actually been made out of stuff that's just disposable. The shapes of the wings have been burnt and they're suspended on fine threads and they hover above the background so they create a, a sense of depth and three dimensions. To delve into all the different aspects that he had to take into consideration when creating it and, and just the, the time and effort that went into sculpting each little butterfly and, and telling the story with what was essentially discarded paper and, he, and photographs and he, and he put everything together in such a beautiful, tender way. Um, I think that really caught my eye. I also wanted to open up the space because there aren't any windows in that space. The idea of banking the wall with framed boxes with, with glass would create a sense of window and, and, and reflection and open up the space. And then also what I've done is the background of the, the boxes, I've graded it very subtly a color from pale blue at the bottom to pink at the top, so it gives a, a feeling of sunrise or sunset. I do think that it is a very beautiful object in the sense that it's able to take someone's personal history and somebody's hard work and all the grit and determination that's gone into starting a project and then coming into fruition and seeing that whole process through something which at first glance just looks really pretty to look at but when you delve deeper you realize that this is somebody's heart and soul and energy that's gone into this and it's a beautiful depiction of that.